Come on, let's walk on the grass then. David Espinal was walking his beloved 10-year-old husky, Loki, on Monday night. Just to get out, go to the bathroom, get his little exercise in. But this routine walk almost turned deadly. When they got home, Loki was erratic. Pacing back and forth in the apartment. So David took him back outside. He just starts taking off and I have to run with him. We're just running back and forth on the street for a good 10, 15 minutes. Does not get tired. Something was off. He drove Loki to the 24-hour med vet clinic down the street. His heart was racing. That's when vets gave Loki a drug test and discovered the dog had ingested meth somewhere along that walk. Um, I didn't think he can just rummage through the bushes and find, and find meth. <laughs> Medvet says it's becoming a lot more common. Dogs either find and eat the drug itself or a piece of drug paraphernalia. Our doctors used to see a couple of cases a year, maybe a handful of cases. Now we're seeing one to two a month. Um, in the last 48 hours, we've actually had two cases. Vets here say most of the cases they see happen when dogs walk near homeless encampments. And if you think your dog ate drugs, they urge you to get to a vet ASAP. As fast as you can, yeah, because yeah, it is life, it is life threatening and it can cause organ damage. Good boy. Espinal is glad Loki made it through after a scare he never could have imagined. I guess you have to be careful when you're just walking your dog. Um, be vigilant. In South San Jose, Ian Cole, NBC Bay Area News.